Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be playing Grand Theft Auto 5 and I'm going to be showing you how I abuse uh, a glitch in the Kaobrico fight uh, to get anything between 1.2 and 1.6 million dollars every 10 minutes. Now the reason I say every 10 minutes is because I'm going to be abusing two glitches. Um, the first glitch is I'm going to be abusing a uh, gold room glitch which you'll see me do uh, in this video but a little bit later on um, and then I'm also going to be using the replay glitch which means that you do not have to do any setups um, towards the end of the heist uh, you do the replay glitch and it means that once you're completely finished um, you do not need to do any heist setups again so you're going to be getting about 1.5 million dollars every 10 minutes so you're going to be getting roughly 10 million dollars an hour which is an insane amount of money and all you need to do this is the Kosatka um, and the Sparrow to help you set up the first time and in fact you don't even need that so all you need is, this, is the Kosatka which is, a, uh, I can't even remember when I purchased it, it was around 4 to 5 million it may be even cheaper now so um, all you're going to want to be doing uh, is if you saw at the start of the um, video I had all the setup so I used the Kosatka to get in um, I go through the drainage tunnel, uh, as you see me right now in this video. Um, you're going to be going through the day just because uh, the glitch gets set up correctly uh, and it's going to be a lot easier to evade the guards if you do it through the day. Um, and apart from that, you can choose whatever weapons you want. However, make sure you put a suppressor on it. It's only 5,000. Um, and that is it. So, it's, yeah, it, that, that, that's really as simple as the glitch is. Um, we're going to be going through the drainage tunnel um, and then once I get through, I'm going to be showing you how to set up the glitch for the uh, gold room. Um, all you're going to be doing is you're going to be glitching through a wall. You're going to be collecting what would normally be a full, um, a full bag of gold. However, this time I was unlucky and only got one gold pile, whereas you normally get two. Uh, so you that's why I say you get anything between 1.2 and 1.6 million. You can also get more if you uh, have a very good setup. I only got the diamond uh, necklace. However, you can get a lot more uh, stuff that's worth it, an awful lot more money. So what you're going to want to do is to do the gold glitches, run all the way up the uh, stairs that you see here. You're going to want to get out your weapon and go to first person and kind of glitch yourself into this tree. What you're going to want to do, uh, you'll see me do right now. Um, is kind of glitch into the tree and you'll fall back down again um, and once you do that that's when you know you've kind of glitched your body out i'll do it one more time just to be lucky um and you're going to want to hide against this wall and wait for the uh, extra secure guard i don't know what you call him to go past and then you're just going to want to run past him and make sure you don't go into his line of sight then you're going to want to wait until this guard passes back over uh, once again, I'm not going to kill any guards apart from a couple that I know I won't get caught on. Uh, so these two guards, you will get caught eventually um, if you kill them. So just let them pass. And then this is how you do the gold glitch. So you're going to want to climb on top of this bush, hug against the wall, climb and push to the right uh, on your D-pad, or not D-pad, on, on your controller, um, and it'll push you into the house. Then what you're going to want to do is collect as much gold as possible. Um, I only got the one pile of gold. However, behind you, you can get a second pile of gold as well, depending on how lucky you are. I didn't get that, unfortunately. So we're just going to continue with the next step, which is follow up these stairs ahead of me that you see. Um, and you're going to want to sneak past this guard and go straight up. And the only person that I'm going to kill is this next person on my left. You're just going to want to wait for them to come around the corner. And once they come around the corner, just shoot them in the head. Uh, that's why you need a suppressor, because otherwise you're going to uh, ruin your, your whole run and you're going to have to reset it again. Once you get in here, you're going to want to grab the key card. Once again, I'm sure you guys have done this a million times. Grab the key card and then open the safe and grab a little bit extra money to see whatever is in the safe. If you guys have a... Um, uh, what am I trying to say? Uh, if you get any paintings up here, make sure you take them. If you didn't get a full uh, bag of gold, 
And after you've done that, you're going to want to print out uh, the fingerprints. Easy way to do this is at the very top, you're going to want to find the first bit of the fingerprint, and then the next one down, you count one along. So the fingerprint is number one at the very, very tip. Uh, next one, you want to go to the very top, and then one along, and then the very top, and then two along, and the very top, and three along, and you'll see me do this uh, repeatedly. So if you count the very tip of the finger uh, fingertip as number one, the next one is number two, you're just going to want to go one, two, three, four, five, six. And that's the easiest way to do this um, tip, well, to, to do the fingerprint, as you see. Uh, I start from one, two, three, four, five, and you just want to uh, go down. Uh, go down the fingerprint. So you'll see me do this one more attempt. Uh, I find number one, which is the very tip. And then from number two, just do the tip and one along. Um, and then you slowly make your way down the fingerprint. So it's very, very simple. Uh, you see me mess up a little bit here, but you can normally get this done in about one minute. I end up doing this run in eight minutes. Um, and then obviously with the loading times, it takes about 10 minutes. If you're doing the uh, glitch as well, then you can repeat this once again every 10 minutes. Uh, so whatever you get per game, times six. Uh, so it's an insane amount of money, really. Um, from here, you'll see me come in uh, and collect whatever the main treasure is. So I've got the diamond or jewel necklace, whatever you call it. However, you can get something that's a lot more expensive. Um, a lot of you still have the uh, Jaguar statue. Um, and I've been doing the replay glitch since the Jaguar statue was still in the game. However, uh, yeah, I don't have that. I stopped playing the game when the Jaguar statue came out. So I just rotate whatever I have. So at the moment, it's the diamond uh, statue. No, diamond, um, diamond necklace. However, sometimes if I get something really good, then I tend to do replay glitch. And I just keep doing that. Once you complete it uh, and get your diamond necklace or whatever you collect, uh, you're going to want to go back through uh, the lift. And once you're done with that, you're going to want to go through the back door and kind of retrace your steps. So you'll see me come down the steps again, and you're going to want to take the first exit that is nearest to you. Um, and the easiest way to do this is to either go round the wall that I'm about to do, uh, or if you've got the keys, you're just going to want to go straight through. At this point, you can start killing people because uh, you're not going to get caught. There's not going to be the gods that are going to be um, catching them for you. For some reason, whenever you go inside on the Cape Rico, any people that you've killed suddenly get caught. Um, just kill all the people that you need, get to this exit, and it's going to go through a funny cinematic. Um, and once you're done, you are basically free. Uh, from that point, I'm going to show you the easiest way that you can escape. Once again, this is by far the quickest way. Um, I do recommend you not do this step if you need to get your um, uh, if you need to get your bag full. However, if you still haven't got your bag full, you can fill it up. But what I do is I just leave it, and that's what I do in this video, just because it uh, you're. It's taken an awful lot longer uh, than if you were to redo the heist. So I just leave it as is. I end up finishing this with 1.3 million, I believe. Um, and yeah, that's worth it for me. Every 10 minutes, 1.3 million is a lot better than getting a couple of hundred extra thousand. Um, now, now that I'm on the motorbike, you'll see what sort of route I take. Uh, I just get over into the ocean completely swim out and then once you do that you are done with the heist and um, once you go into the loading screen you're going to want to do the replay glitch and then from that you can um, co completely repeat this all over again rewatch the video if you need to watch it again um, and you can be getting an awful lot of money so uh, shortly I'm going to be uploading how to do the replay glitch on this channel. So if you don't know how to do it, then stay tuned. And uh, yeah, that, that will show you uh, how to do this uh, this trip. Uh, sorry, I can't speak today. I'm um, teaching you how to do this uh, strategy from the start to the finish. Um, so yeah, make sure you keep an eye out for that. So uh, I've got 30 million at the moment. I end with 32, very good glitch. Um, and yeah, that, that's the end of the video. That's as simple as that. Uh, sorry that I've been rambling on. I've tried to do this all in one take. Uh, however, I am very tired and I'm going to be going to bed after this. So I'm going to end this video now. If you guys did enjoy it, please make sure to click the like button down um, at, at the bottom of this video and click the subscribe button if you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see more content from me. But anyway, guys, that has been me. Um, and hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Bye now.